Hello everyone, uh, this is Lakshman. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. In this video, I am going to talk about uh, one of the uh, frequently asked interview questions that is when to use abstract class and when to use interface in Java. Uh, this question is a very uh, tough question to, for pressures. So, Please watch this video until last, then you clearly understand when to use abstract class and interface in Java. Okay. First, let me uh, define what is the abstract class. Abstract class is a class which contains at least one abstract method. Here, abstract method means the method which does not have the any implementation it just have method signature that means without body the method has without body only method signature is available such type of uh, uh, methods are abstract methods if any class contains abstract method then that class is called as an abstract class okay so how to uh, define uh, abstract class means by using abstract keyword. We need to use a keyword abstract. Then what is the use of abstract class? By using the abstract class, we can achieve the abstraction, which is one of the OOPS concept. Here abstraction means which shows functionality by hiding the implementation details is called an abstraction then when to we use abstract class if we have uh, any requirement where few set of functionalities common across all the subclasses and a few functionalities is different from subclasses then the common functionalities you can define in the abstract class but an abstract class cannot instantiate it it can be only be used as a super class for other classes that extend the abstract class. That means if you know partial implementation but not completely, then abstract class is good choice. That means you don't know 100% uh, requirements from the clients. You know only partial implementation. But at that time, you need to choose abstract class only instead of interface. In addition to abstract method, we can declare concrete method also in the abstract class. And uh, for abstract method, there is no restrictions to declare any modifiers like a private, protected, final. Okay. Then what is an interface? Interface is a 100% abstract method. That means it does not have any implementation. Okay. It contains only method declaration. Whatever methods declared in interface should be implemented by classes that implements the interface. Remember that a class can implement more than one interface but can extend only one class. So interfaces also cannot be create objects like abstract class. Then when do we use interface? In Java, multiple inheritance problem is solved with a with a powerful construct called interface. Okay, interface contains only abstract methods. That means interface contains only abstract method. There is no concrete methods in interface. Interface just to specify method declaration, but no body of the method. If you use the interface, you would need to implement all the methods in the class that extends the interface. If you would like to support for future expansion when using interfaces, you will need to extend the interface and create new one. That's it. You can use the interface if you want to a con a contract on some functionality. You can also use interface to restrict access numbers of particular type because all number variables are private, static and final 
in interface whether you are declaring or not. Interface are a good choice when you think that the API will not change for a while. And interface are also good when you want to have something similar to multiple inheritance. Since you can implement multiple inheritance using interface. So that's all about uh, when to use interface and when to use an abstract class. So thank you for watching.